Friday at 11, we told you about a family in East Point with no water for three weeks. They couldn't get their pipe fixed because the neighbors weren't allowing work to spill onto their property. It ended with an agreement, so we thought. Jason Colthorpe back in East Point today with an update. So Saturday morning, I get a text from Patrice, the homeowner, who said the rep from the management company that owns the property in the back has now changed his mind and the work can't be completed. So I went to work again, trying to figure out how we can get past that fence and get her water turned back on. I woke up Saturday and I just was like, there has to be an end to this. After three weeks, the end was getting harder for Patrice Miller O'Rear to see. And when the property management called me and spoke to me the way he did, I immediately reached out to you and that's when things started changing. We usually just knock on the door. They're like, go ahead. We would have been done that day if it was a normal situation. It's not unusual for work like this to spill into a neighbor's yard. The fences don't know where the pipes are, but the contractor says the longer the delay in this case, the more dangerous the job was becoming. So even as we're standing here now, little bits of rainwater are soaking that ground underground, making it softer and it's all sand here. So that's why it keeps just falling in. After I requested to talk to the owner of the management company, suddenly things changed and Patrice got a phone call from the owner. And he was just like, how can we help? You know, just as long as you send me a text saying that this is going to, you know, he's like, I'm not expecting a lands a big landscaping job. I just, just fill the hole in. I'm very relieved. Um, still have a today to get through. So hopefully tomorrow is the start of some normalcy. As you can see, the work is progressing. They've got the fence down now and they're on their way to repairing this. And the guys at H2O tell me they expect to have this job done today and even better yet for Patrice. They're not charging her for all the days that it took to get everything in order and get this job done. In East Point, Jason Coulter for Local 4.